Welcome to the Early Learning Coalition of Duval Provider Portal Tutorial. This video will show you how to upload documents in the document library. Before you begin uploading documents to the portal, it's important to develop a secure filing system on your computer for all required documents for school readiness and VPK. This can be as simple as creating one folder on your computer for school readiness documents and another folder for VPK documents. Filing your documents will help streamline the process of transferring files from your computer into the document library. As you scan documents on your computer, please follow these guidelines when labeling or naming each file. Documents with expiration dates should be labeled to include the document type and expiration date. For example, if you are scanning a DCF license with an expiration date of April 10, 2016, please label the document license 4 10 2016 If the document is specific to a staff member, please include the document type, staff name, and expiration date. For example, a background screening for Jane Doe that expires on December 10, 2017 should be labeled BGS Jane Doe 12 10 2017. Documents without an expiration date, such as a SunBiz report or a direct deposit form, can be labeled by the document type. If the document is specific to a staff member, please include the document type and the person's name. For example, an affidavit of good moral character for Jane Doe should be labeled GMC Jane Doe. Once you've scanned and correctly labeled all required documents to your computer, you are ready to begin uploading to the document library. First, you will need to log into the provider portal by visiting providers.elcduval.org or by locating the portal link on the coalition website. If you need help accessing the portal, please refer to the video tutorial entitled Accessing the Provider Portal or contact the Coalition's Provider Services team. When you've arrived on the portal homepage, you'll need to log into your account by entering your username and password on the left side of the screen. If you have not created a user account on the provider portal, please refer to the video tutorial entitled Creating a User Account or contact the Coalition's Provider Services team. Once you've entered your username and password, click the blue login button or press enter. This will take you to the provider dashboard. The provider dashboard is the main screen in the provider portal. From this screen, users can navigate to all areas of the portal. To upload a document, click the visit the document library link. There are several folders to choose from when uploading documents. Select the drop down arrow to view the list of all folders. Each folder in the document library is used for different types of documents. Here is a brief description of each folder. The License, Exemptions, and Gold Seal folder is for your DCF license or exemption letter, accreditation certificates, and or your Gold Seal certificate. The Insurance folder is for your Certificate of General Liability Insurance and or your Automobile Insurance if applicable. The Banking Information folder is for your completed W-9, direct deposit form, voided check, and or advanced payment forms. The Screenings folder is for the Level 2 Clearance Letter and Affidavit of Good Moral Character for all VPK staff. The Credentials folder is where you will upload the education information or credentials for your VPK instructors and directors. The VPK Calendar folder is for the VPK Calendar Worksheet. If your program follows the Duval County Public School Calendar, you will need to upload the Calendar Z form. The Additional Support Documentation folder is for your SunBiz Report, Signature Authorization form, or any additional information requested by the Early Learning Coalition. To upload a document to a folder in the Document Library, select the correct folder from the drop-down menu. Click the Add New Document button. In the pop-up box, click Browse to select the document from your computer you wish to upload. Please enter a document description and expiration date if applicable. Then select Upload Document. To determine whether the upload is complete, select the folder where the document was uploaded and verify it is there. You have successfully uploaded a document to the document library. 
When you have finished uploading all required documents, click Home at the top left of the screen to return to the provider dashboard. For more details on how to navigate the provider portal, please visit the Coalition website at www.elcduval.org and click the yellow Provider Services button at the bottom of the page.